Welcome to another episode of Winging It here on Rhino's World. I'm taking advantage of a flavor that is extremely popular, some would say too popular this time of year. I'm going to sell out to popularity and make some pumpkin spice chicken wings. No, I don't expect these wings to taste any good, but I got to do it anyway, just in case, and because I'm crazy. Of course, to make some pumpkin spice chicken wings, I'm going to need some pumpkin spice. And I've got all the ingredients for that here. First, we have cinnamon. If nothing else, I'm getting rid of a whole bunch of cinnamon that I'm probably never going to use. Next, we have some ginger. Next, we got some nutmeg. Next, we have some allspice. And lastly, some cloves. Now we shake it up real good just to even things out. By the way, this recipe came from BettyCrocker.com. I'll put the link to the original recipe in the description below. But this only constitutes half of our rub. For the real rub, I'm going to mix one part of this pumpkin spice with one part of this brown sugar. So there we are. Pumpkin spice dry rub, half pumpkin spice, half brown sugar. Let's apply it to some chicken. Application time. Here we go. And that's what pumpkin spice chicken wings look like before they're cooked. So now, of course, we put the wings in the fridge for the requisite hour. After which we get cooking. I can't believe I'm gonna eat chicken wings that smell like that. Okay, wings have been in the fridge for an hour. Oven has now preheated. Now time to stick them in the oven. Whoa, rushy heat. I never get used to that. And here we go. One. Okay, here we go. And oh, whoosh. I never get. Ugh. And here they are. They look a little bit black than the ones on the near side. But we'll see how bad they are for real. We have pumpkin spice chicken wings right over here. I'm a little scared to try them, but it, uh, let's just get it out of the way. Here comes the flap here. It doesn't smell like anything a chicken should smell like, but time to take the plunge. Pumpkin spice chicken wing. Cheers. That is shockingly not awful. I did not expect it to be not awful. I expected it to be repulsed by this, and I'm not. It's not great, but it's still not terrible. This is a rare occasion where I'm sort of at a loss. I'm at a loss for words. I can't, I can't think of what to say other than this is surprisingly not a terrible chicken wing. I think it could use a lot of improvement. I'm thinking maybe increase the um, amount of sugar to give it a little bit more of a sweetness give it more of a glaze on the wing while at the same time maybe adding some salt as well to give it a little bit of a savoriness as well I think both of those would do these wings really well but shockingly they're not awful I, I expected much worse than this let's try a drum all right here we are pumpkin spice drum cheers Pumpkin spice flavors go very well together. Given the amount of cinnamon that was in that mix, I thoroughly expected that to really stand out and pronounce itself, but it's not. And I like that. Again, overall, definitely needs more sugar to sweeten it up and a little bit of salt to add a bit of savoriness. I'd say they're okay. Not great, not awful, just okay. I'm curious now what would happen if I did put some sugar and salt into this mix. 
On that note, I think that will do it for another episode of Winging It here on Brian's World. I want to thank you all very, very much for watching. If you got ideas for strange wing flavors I could try on this show, leave a comment down below. Otherwise, don't forget to like this video, share it with all your friends, and subscribe if you have not done so already. And please do subscribe because if and when I reach 100 subs, I will attempt the Carolina Reaper Chicken Wing Challenge, which will be nowhere near as pleasant as trying those pumpkin spice wings that I just had. And of course, if you got money burning a hole in your pocket, you can always waste it on Bright House World t-shirts and hoodies with links somewhere here, here, or in the description, or all over the place. Once again, thanks for watching. Have yourself a good one. And now I'm going to eat myself some normal chicken wings right here.